Happening tomorrow, Santa Claus is coming to Lexington for the Christmas parade. And joining us this morning to tell us all about the event is Laura Farnsworth from the Downtown Lexington Partnership. We're so excited to have you with us. I'm so excited to be here. Oh my gosh, the parade is going to be already so, so exciting. I mean, literally about 12 this time tomorrow, mm -hmm. we'll be setting up, getting ready to go, right? Yes in our jackets and our all of our fun stuff. It's about 24 hours out. So give us the details as far as when it starts, where the best place to watch from, just where it's going to go. Definitely. So it starts at 11 o'clock sharp tomorrow morning on Main Street in downtown. And so it'll start Main Street and Midland Avenue uh, out by the old Herald Leader Building. It'll travel down Main Street to uh, Mill Street, which is right past the Fifth Third Pavilion Tandy Park area. So really anywhere along that stretch, it's about three quarters of a mile. Anywhere along that stretch is going to be a great seat to, to sit down and watch the program. What time do you think people should maybe head out if they do want to come watch and get a good spot? I mean, how early do people start lining up? You know, people start lining up between 1030, 1045. Mm -hmm. um, Main Street will stay open until about 1045. So if your plan is to come down and park, say, in the Helix garage or the Fifth Third garage, any time between 1030 quarter tills, probably about your best bet. How many floats we got this year? 50 entries. Wow. I know. So it's it's gotten bigger this year. The good weather helps. Obviously, mm -hmm. we're thankful for that. But we've got everybody, including, of course, Santa Claus. Well, of course. And it's the kind of thing where people can come down for the parade, but then stick around for other things. You all have shops that are going to be open and, and the, the ice skating rink, just all kinds of stuff. Absolutely. We actually will have um, an activation at the ice rink, the rink at Triangle Park from noon to two following the parade. We'll have some special guests down on the ice there. Um, it is open for the season every day. Shops are going to be open restaurants, the farmer's market will be open. So downtown will be bustling tomorrow. You know, I hate to bring it down, but we all know about the situation that happened in Wisconsin. Have you all taken any extra security measures this year? We have. Of course, our partners at the Lexington Police Department will be well staffed, heavily staffed. Every intersection, every point that anyone might enter the parade will be staffed, most likely with a cruiser, an officer, and a barricade. So they're taking care of us. Good deal. Well, we appreciate that for sure. I know we're all going to be out there. Jim's going to join us and, you know, we'll be walking the, the length of it. And he did well with weather, didn't he? He did well with weather. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Goodness for that. Thank you so much.